Good morning and welcome to today's kickboxing. Four minute rounds, 10 rounds total. Okay? A few things about these rounds. If you've never kickboxed with us before, just a few pointers. When I say get into your dominant fight stance, you're standing straight on and I say, all right, let's start to fight. Or dukes up, put them up, start to aim back at you. What is your natural position? Okay? For most people, their dominant side is going to be in the back. And the reason is because in kickboxing and in regular boxing, your power comes from your core. So it's going to be coming from this, okay, the back side of that punch. All right? So for me, I'm right-handed. My right side is away from you because I want all my power in that last punch. Okay? So obviously, your non-dominant stance is the reverse. Another pointer is always keep your fists up, okay? Keep your guard up. You aren't gonna be throwing a punch like that and expect to get hit in the face, no. You're gonna keep your guard up as you are throwing and kicking those, or throwing those punches and doing those kicks, okay? All right, now let's get started. All right, let's start it out with a light jog, okay? So, like I said, the rounds are four minutes long. That'll give us a good chance to get in that progressive kickboxing move. Okay. Start with one move, kind of build it up, and we'll be able to switch sides. The lifting, you're going to be able to concentrate more on your lifts. Okay. Concentrate on the weight, on the muscle groups that you're targeting. All of it. Alright, let's take it to a Body squat, feet wider than shoulder width. Squat it down, lift your knee up. Okay, we gotta get these joints warm because we are throwing some kicks in there, punches. All right, now, at any point you need a longer break, push pause, march it out. We try to keep the moves fairly simple. Okay, all right. One more on each side. We're going to take it to chest openers. Yes, because you are going to be working your chest, your arms, your body, swimmers. You're not going to be working your shoulders, but you're going to be working their shoulders. All right, and reverse it. Yes. Okay, uh, like I was saying. I'm going to show you progressions, side to side speed. So if you need to stay at level one or at the mellow level, do that. If you want to take it up a notch, take it up a notch. You control the intensity. You're warming up those inner thighs and outer thighs. Oh yeah. And it'll be good. All right, our first series is going to be and kickboxing series. All right, take it back to another light jog. Okay, I'm going to show you what they look like. Okay, your first one. We're going to start off in your dominant fight stance, and we're going to start off with a jab. So a jab is your forward facing the front arm. Okay, that's a jab. Cross is coming from behind. You're going across your body. A hook is driving, like you're going straight across. An uppercut is just that, an uppercut. You are aiming for the person's chin. Yeah, those are the basic punches. Your basic kicks that we're going to be doing is a front kick. You're going to load it up, kick front, side kick, kick side without losing your balance, and a back kick. Okay. Starting off with a jab. Jab. Okay. Now, notice my feet aren't. I'm not completely parallel to you. Okay. We're at an angle. Okay. And I'm bouncing back and forth. You don't have to. My guard is up. Okay. Getting ready to add in that hook of the other side. Okay. So you're gonna go jab hook, jab, hook, jab, hook. 
jab, hook, jab, hook. When you are hooking, you are bringing up this back leg and you're hooking into it. Because remember, I said all that power, it doesn't come from just your arms, it comes from your torso. Okay? Jab, hook, jab, hook, jab, hook. Okay. Ready to add on? We're going to add on a side kick. Okay? So, it's going to look like this. You're going to jab, hook, plant your foot here. Now this foot is turned forward. Side kick. Okay. Jab, hook. Keeping somebody in the side. Jab, hook. Plant this foot all the way to here. Kick. Got to reset. Jab, hook, kick. Jab, hook, kick. Okay, jab, hook. Load it up. Notice my body weight. Kick, jab, hook, kick. Jab, hook, kick. Jab, hook, kick. A few more seconds. And then we're going to switch sides. Okay? Jab, hook, kick. One more. All right. Non dominant stance. Start it off with that nice, easy jab. Okay? Now, it is perfectly normal to feel a little more awkward on your non dominant side. Oh, pardon. Okay? Jab. Jab, jab. Now my punches are going straight out from where I am at, okay? Not necessarily where your opponent's at, okay? So this is all based on you. Add in that hook. Jab, hook, jab, hook, jab, hook, jab, hook, okay? Once you have gotten that motion down, you can go a little quicker. Okay? You can continue to say it. Jab, hook, jab, hook, jab, hook, jab, hook, jab, hook. Okay? You ready to add on? Yeah? Okay, we're going to add on that side kick. In two, one, jab, hook, plank this foot, kick, jab, hook, Come back, jab, hook, kick, jab, hook. Now, if you can't high kick, do a low kick. Kick them in the shins. Jab, hook, kick, jab, hook, kick, jab, hook, kick. Okay, you're aiming for midsection. So anywhere from about mid thigh to chest. Okay, can't get your knees up that high. Take out their knees. Okay, jab, hook. Kick, jab, hook, kick. You have five seconds. Jab, hook, kick. One more. Jab, hook, kick. You made it through your first round. All right. Now, grab some water. We have a squat series coming up. So, pick your weight supporting leg. Okay. I'm gonna go with 15. Okay. So. Your squats stay on one side for the first two minutes, okay? Make sure you have good, stable base, feet or shoulder width apart. Pick your favorite leg, and that's the one you're going to start with, okay? You're going to lunge forward, you're going to lunge side, and then you're going to reverse lunge, okay? Forward, side, reverse. This is what you're doing. And then two minutes later, you're going to start with the other leg. Okay? Get ready to go. Alright. Now, any point during your weights, okay, you feel the weights are getting too much, or that your form is starting to suffer, drop the weights. Okay? I care more about function and form over reps. All right. Okay. So when you are going forward, your forward knee does not go out over your toes. It is right over your heel. Okay. 
that back knee just a few inches off the ground. Going to the side, same thing. Okay, reverse, back. Now all the weights in this front heel, and you're going straight down. Okay, forward, side, reverse. Okay, notice you want to take it up a notch, float that foot. Okay, don't let it drop. Okay, we're over halfway done with this side. Okay. If you need to tap it in between, by all means, tap it in between, okay? You don't have weights at home, by weight, okay? All right, we're gonna be switching in 20 seconds, okay? Like I said, we're here for a while because it's three different moves. Forward lunging, side lunge, and reverse lunge. Okay, get ready to switch slides. Three, two, one, switch. Forward, side, reverse. Okay, you may have to watch your area. Okay. Don't want you stepping on something and twisting your ankle. Yeah, you should notice that you're breathing a little heavier because you're working large muscle groups. Okay? Good. Feeling that burn? Yeah? Should be. Okay? You need to take a break, take a quick break, okay? I don't want your form to start to suffer. You need to drop those weights down, shake it out, do that, because body weight, you can certainly do body weight, okay? If you don't, you can use a band around either your thighs, around your calves, It'll get you that good isometric hold. You're getting it either way. Come on, the last 30 seconds. Ready? You've got this. You can do hard things, okay? I say that a lot, and I mean it, okay? You will be amazed at what your body can do. Alright? You have five, four, three, two. Good job. Put those ones away. Alright. Grab some water. Okay? Shake it out. Keep moving. Okay. We're back to another series of punches and kicks. Okay. First one is an uppercut. Okay. So you're in your dominant fighting stance. Okay. Uppercut. When you uppercut, you are going away from your body. Okay. It's almost like you're going up at an angle, like at a 45, okay? Because that's where that power is coming from. Mm -hmm. So it's an uppercut, and then an uppercut, jab, side kick, okay? Start with just a regular uppercut. Upper, upper, okay? Upper. I am dropping my shoulder, because that's where that power comes from on that uppercut. Upper, upper, upper. Uppercut, uppercut. You are aiming for your opponent's chin, not yours. Upper, upper, upper. Come on. Let's add in that second uppercut. Go upper, 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 upper. Come on. Okay. 
Now, when you are doing that second uppercut, again, shoulders dipping and you're moving up. Up. Ready? Let's add in that jab. Upper, upper, jab. Upper, upper, jab. Upper, upper, jab. Good. Ready? Let's add in that kick. Upper, upper, jab. Bring this foot forward. Kick. Upper, upper, jab. Bring this foot forward. You're kicking that way. Kick. Upper, upper, jab. Slight kick. Notice I'm bending down, loading up. Boom. Okay? Upper, upper, jab. Kick. Upper, upper, jab. <laughs> kick. See, even I forget. Upper, upper, jab. Kick. Back. Upper, upper, jab. Load up. Kick. Reset. Upper, upper, jab. Kick on his buddy. Upper, upper, jab. You're kicking that buddy that's coming. Okay? You have five more seconds. And then we're switching sides. All right. Ready? Start with that upper. Upper cut. Upper. 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 Come on. All right. Your other, other arm is up at that guard. Okay. Let's add in that second upper. 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 Okay. You're turning your shoulders into them. Okay. You are exhaling as you are bringing up that punch. Upper, 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 upper. Ready to add on? Upper, upper, jab. Upper, upper, jab. Upper, upper, boom. Okay. They aren't gonna know what hit them. Okay. You're giving them two uppercuts, knocking them back. Upper, upper, knocking them back. Ready? You wanna add on? That kick to get rid of his buddy that's coming up. Yeah. Upper, upper, jab, load up, kick, reset. Upper, upper, jab, load up, kick, and back. Upper, upper, jab. Upper, upper, jab. Upper, upper, jab. Okay, you're kicking with your heel. Upper, upper, jab. So flex that foot. And boom. Okay, upper, upper, jab. Boom. Upper, upper, jab. Boom. Good. Upper, upper, jab. 15 seconds left. <gasps> 10. Can we get in? One more. Upper, upper, jab. One more. Upper, upper, jab. Good job. Shake out. We have whew, some of my favorites. Curtsy lunge. Actually, we're starting off with sumos. Sumo hop. So I would say probably a lighter weight. Okay. Yes, it is a sumo. Normally I would go heavy, like 40 or more. But we're adding hop in. So your feet are out wide, pointed in the corners, okay? Five and eight pound. You're gonna drop it down and hop up, okay? So whether you have the weight here and you're hopping down or you have it down here, it doesn't matter, okay? Take a good breather, grab some water. We're starting. Five, four, three, two, sumo. Hop, sumo, hop. Okay? Now, you can't hop. Sumo, go up on your heels, or on your heels, on your toes. Okay? Sumo, heel, sumo. There you go. Okay? Now, you can do it a regular sumo if you wish. Okay? Just trying to give you options here. So, you are doing regular sumo. I prefer to have my weight down here. Okay? I'm just gonna go down. Not all the way. Good. Alright. You're gonna need 
two ways for this next one. Okay, because it is a curtsy lunge. All right, I'm gonna grab my second weight here. Uh, all right, I'll go with 20s, why not? Okay, so your curtsy lunge. You're gonna start off feet facing forward. You're gonna drop one foot back at an angle. Your knees are gonna be in one line and you're gonna go down. And you're gonna bring it back. And, okay, when you are going down, you're sticking your booty out. Okay, so from the side, you can tell my knees are in alignment. I'm going down and I'm sticking out my side glute. Okay. Good. We have another 10 seconds here. And then we're switching to your other leg. You don't need to be lopsided, right? Okay, you need to switch out the weights. Switch out the weights. I'm going back to my 15s. Switch to the other side. Okay. Ready? Other side. And down. Okay, now this one can easily be done with resistant loops. Okay, it can be done body weight. It's a good one. If you're doing body weight, kind of hold it down here for five seconds and then come up. Okay? Feel that burn and that quad and that outer glute and that outer thigh. Ooh, all over. All right. Almost done with this one. And then we're going to just a simple calf raise. Okay? So, let's do one more here. All right, calf raise. Feet pointed straight. You're just going up on your toes. Keep the weights down. You can load them up on your shoulders, whichever's more comfortable for you, okay? But you are just simply going up on your toes, gliding back down, okay? May not look like much, may not necessarily feel like much, but it is. You'll feel it. Okay? It's a nice and slow, controlled movement on the way down. Okay? You can try not to let your heels actually touch the ground. Okay? Ten more seconds. <gasps> Breathe. We get a 60 second break here. And we go back to throwing punches. In two. All right. Okay. I'm going to grab some water. Always important to have water. Okay. Have to hydrate in between. All right. Our next series is just a simple jab, cross, and a switch kick. Which I think switch kicks are probably one of my favorite kicks when it comes to kickboxing. Okay, so your, your dominant stance, you're going to jab, cross, and then a switch kick is you're going to switch your feet and kick with, so I'm going to be kicking with my left leg. Okay, jab, cross, I'm going to jump forward, kick with my other foot and then reset. Jab, cross, switch, boom. Okay? We'll get there. Just start it off with the jab. Okay? Nice simple jab. Okay? Just kind of teasing. Yeah? Have you ever been fishing? Okay? You're fishing for bass. You can see them. We're going to bop them on the head. Bop. Bop until they finally butt. Okay? All right, let's add in my cross. Jab, cross, jab, cross, jab, cross, jab, cross is where that power is. Remember, jab, cross, jab, cross, jab, cross. All right, I'm gonna add in that switch kick. 
Okay. Here we go. In two. Last one. All right. Jab, cross, switch, kick. Okay. Jab, cross, switch your feet, kick. Now, when I'm kicking, I'm also crunching, bringing my knee up. Boom. Back down. Reset. Jab, cross. Boom. Jab, cross. Kick. Jab, cross. Kick it up. Okay. Jab, cross. Now, if you need to step, step. Kick. Reset. Jab, cross, step. Kick. You can do that. Jab, cross, step. Can't kick that high. Any further shins? It'll still hurt. Okay. Jab, cross. We've all hit our shins in the middle of the night. And some piece of furniture. That hurts like the son of a gun. Oh, yeah. Okay. Let's do two more. Jab, cross, kick. One more. Jab, cross. All right. Shake it out. Go to the other side. Simple jab. 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 Good. You guys are halfway through this workout. Okay. Jab. 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 Okay. This, you can take care of. Some of those frustrations. Oh. All right. Is that in that cross? Jab, cross. Jab, cross. Jab, cross. Jab, cross. Jab, cross. You got jab, cross. Come on. Jab, cross. Jab, cross. Good. All right. You want to add in that switch kick? This one's going to feel funny. Okay. Ready? One more, jab, cross, okay. Jab, cross, switch, kick. Jab, cross, switch, kick. Jab, cross, bring that foot up, kick it up, okay. Jab, cross, kick. Jab, cross, jab, cross, okay. jab, cross, boom. Good, jab, cross, switch, Kick. Now, if the kick is too much, you can do a knee drive. Okay? Jab, cross, grab their neck, boom. Okay? Jab, cross. Kick it up. You can do it. I always add another extra punch when I kick. Okay? Reset. Jab, cross. Get one more. Jab, cross, kick. I like one more. There you go. Yes. Do you hate it when the trainer says one more and they lie? Hmm. I learned that from my band director. Okay. Grab some water. We have upper bodies. Okay. We have a curl to an overhead press. And then some tricep kickbacks in a plank. You know, easy stuff, right? Okay. So, hmm. All right. So, from curls, elbows in tight. Okay. You're curling up, up, switching the palms. Pressing it overhead, okay? Important. When you are curling and pressing, go. I don't want to see your shoulders up by your ears, okay? Be nice, relaxed. You have a good, firm balance, so your feet are at shoulder width. Curl, press it up. When you press up, push your shoulders down, okay? You've got it. Okay. Curl up and press. And back down. Okay. Curl up. Now, my knees are slightly bent to help with that press up. Okay. Curl up. Press. 
it's okay if you use a little bit of power with your legs. That's what they're there for. And press. Good. Ready? Curl up. And press. Good. Curl up. Concentrate on those curls. Okay, keep those elbows in tight. Curl up. All right. One more. I'm going to show you your next one. It's going to be a push up. Yes, I did. Okay, so you are in the push up position. So it means your arms are straight. You're going to go down. You're going to come up. Bring one arm up and do a tricep kick back. Okay, so if you need to be on your knees for this one, be on your knees for it. Okay, go down. are too tricky for you. Just do a push-up, okay? Or just be here in plank and do the kickbacks. You don't have to do the combo, okay? You can do it. I know you can. I am going, eh, let's stay with these. All right, here we're halfway through, okay? I got a special little treat on this one. Ready? So, I'm gonna go down, whew, up, kick it back. Now, my feet are out wide, okay? I have a good wide base. Down, and back, okay? You can also just simply row it up, okay? Row it up. We have options, people, it's okay. All right? I'm going to take a little break. Yeah? It's okay. Because here in 10 seconds, we're just holding plank. Whether you're in big plank or straight arm plank, forearm plank, I don't care. We're holding it plank. Okay? You can hold plank all day long. Okay. Thank you. All right. Good plank form. You are squeezing those thighs, your quads. You're squeezing those glutes together, okay? Tucking in your tummy. You got this, okay? You have 15 seconds left. Come on, hold it. 10, nine, come on. Five, four, three, Two. Stretch it out. Yeah, you deserve that child's pose. All right, put those weights back because we have a kick series. Grab some water. I need some. And notice. So far, we haven't done a single type of burpee. You should be proud and happy. Okay, your first one is a front kick or a push kick. Okay, you're in your fight stance. You're gonna be pushing with this back leg. Fists are up. You're gonna push, and then it's gonna be a jump cross. Okay. You're pushing them down, jack cross, and you're aiming down. Okay? We're starting with that push hip. Okay? You are pushing them away. Okay? Push. It's like a bicycle move movement. Okay? Knee up, foot out, and you're circling it back around. Okay? Boom. Okay? And come back. Alright? Good. All that weight's in this leg, okay? Let's add on. I'm gonna add on these two jabs because they're gonna be in quick succession, okay? The reason why is you just kicked your opponent down, so you're aiming down, you're gonna go jab across, okay? 
push the tip cross. You're aiming down. I'm losing my head, babe. Are you ready? Push kick, jump cross. And you're back. Push kick, jump cross. And you're back. Good. Keep that up, okay? Ready? Push kick, jab cross, because they're down on the ground, okay? I know. Mama always said, don't kick somebody when they're down. She doesn't say anything about catching them when they're down, right? All right. Jab cross. Because, you know, there's a reason I'm coming at you. Okay? Jab cross. I just totally messed that up, didn't I? I did. Push kick, jab cross. Push kick, jab cross. It's all that training, I tell you. Push kick, jab cross. Yeah. You know when the training B rail is in the middle of teaching. All right, do one more on this side. Push, jab cross. And we're going to switch it to the other side. Start with that push kick. You were pushing them down. Now this one feels so weird for me. Push and jab. All right. You're going to push them down. You're stepping back. Push. Okay. You're going to land forward. Boom. Because you're pushing them back. Okay. And then after a while, It'll become a little more stable for you. Okay. All right. Are you ready to add in those two jab blows? Yeah. I think so. Hopefully, I won't mess it up for you this time, right? All right. Let's do one more. All right. Ready? Push back. Jab. Okay. Push back. Jab. Cross. Okay. Push them back. Take them when they're down. Punch them when they're down. Ready? Okay. And you're back because you don't know when they're going to scroll back up. Okay? Come at me. And you're back. 30 more seconds. Ready? Kick. And you're back. Kick. And you're back. Back. Okay. Notice my stance has kind of gotten a little wider sometimes on the kicks. That's okay. Kick. And you're back. Kick. Jab, jab. Ready? Let's get in. Two more. One more. Push. Good job. All right. Now, these you will need light weights, okay? Because they're shoulder. You're doing front and shoulder or front and shoulder raises. Can't talk today. We're doing thank you raises. Mm -hmm. Yes. T and H raises. So. Wait. I'm gonna grab some water. Maybe that'll help my speech. My speech teacher would be so disappointed. Alright, so it's not that I'm wimpy, but I don't want to burn my shoulders out too much. So I'm only using fives right now. Okay? They're called thank you shoulders. <laughs> Doing a ladder roll. Lateral, elbows are slightly bent, feet, shoulder width apart, weights don't go above the shoulders. Okay. Lateral, the H. Okay. The T and the H. Okay, so from the side, my feet, my body's all in one straight line, my elbows are slightly bent. Okay, they are going above my shoulders. I'm leading with my pinkies. And then straight out. Okay? Now, you find yourself when you are doing the front raises, 
them to swing. That means you have too much weight. Okay? All right. Shoulder. Ooh. Okay? Now, if you need to take it down a little, you can take it down. Just do smaller movements. Okay? Lighter weights or no weights. Okay? Because guess what? Your arms weigh something. Okay? They're about two to three pounds. Yeah. All right. You don't have weights, band, or an ISO. No excuses here. Okay. All right. Here in ten seconds, we're gonna drop down and do cross mountain climbers. Yeah. I am. Okay. So you're gonna be in a good mountain climber. When I say cross, I mean one knee to the opposite elbow. Okay, but I also, if you can, want you to be going up and down. Right? You can do it at a time. Alright, are you are you down here with me? Come on. What are you waiting on? Me to tell you to come down here? <laughs> yes, you probably were, weren't you? Alright, now if this is too much, okay. Get down in here on four plank and do a knee to elbow. Okay? This is your other option. You've got it. Okay? All right. You need to take a quick break because I just burned out your shoulders. Do that. Get back in child's pose. It's okay. Both of those are too much. That's what? You can sit here. Cross it out in a mountain climber, okay? Because in 10 seconds, you're doing hip dips. What are hip dips? You're in forearm plank, and you were dipping one side and the other, all right? Okay, you can join me anytime now. Come on, okay? My feet are a little wider than shoulder width. And we're turning with those obliques, okay? I'm using those obliques. I said use them. Mm -mm. Come on. Good. Now, if you can't tap all the way to the floor, that's okay. Come on. You're almost there. I burned out my shoulders. And then I'm back. Okay? Come on. We have 15 seconds left. And then we get to jab it out again, okay? <gasps> Come on. We need a good strong core. It holds up the rest of your body. Okay. Three, two. Child's pose, cobra, all of the above. All right. So. We have a high-low jab, and we're doing high-low hooks, and doing kicks, okay? So your high-low jabs, it's going to be horse jabs, okay? So jab, 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 your high, squat it down low, okay? Same with the hooks, your high, and then your low high, and then you're low. We have cameo. Ready? You're going to start in on those jabs. Three, two, jab. High, high, low, low. How fast can you go? Ready? High, high, low, low. High, low. Come on. This is your Second to last round, okay? High, high, low, low. High, high, low, low. High, high, low, low. I'm in a horse, this is what they call a horse stance. Okay, you're, you're straight on. Okay, high, high, low, low. High, high, low, low. It's a fluid movement, come on. This is meant to burn it out. Ready? We're switching to those hooks. 
in three, two, hooks. Okay. Hook, 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 hook. Come on. You've got it. Same motion. Okay. Now, if you can't do the squats in between, you can still do this. Okay. Hook, 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 hook. Okay. Now you're getting somebody shorter than you. more seconds of hooks. Okay. You've got it. This is when you need to dig deep. Okay. Now, we're moving in to front kicks. Okay. So, kick, kick, kick. You're standing too straight. You are kicking. Okay. Almost like you're doing a high switch kick. Okay, but you are crunching in when you are doing those kicks. Okay, come on. High kick. Okay, you need to take it down. Okay, you can take it down a little notch, it's all right. There you go. You've got this. Come on. Fucking thing. Okay? Side kicks. Side kick. Side kick. Side kick. Side kick. Side kick. Okay? You've got it. Ready? Side. 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 Come on. Now he's gonna army crawl. Ready? Take it to a reverse kick. Okay? You're kicking behind you now. Kick. 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 Kicking behind. Okay? It's like a donkey kick. You're loading up. You're kicking behind you. Ready? Come on. You're almost done. See, I told you. I always punch whenever I kick. It's just one of those things. It's like counterbalance, right? Yes. Come on. 20 seconds left. You're almost there. Come on. Kick it out for me. I know. This one <gasps> is a little harder. Okay, come on, you have five, three, two, one. All right, to your last set of work. Okay, so this one is a throwback to some of my early aerobics days. Okay, shout out to Shailene Johnson for this one. We are gonna need one heavy weight and prop it up on its end, okay? Because you're gonna go high, high, low, low, and then you're gonna do a lead. One, two, three, four. Pick up and do a kettlebell swing. One, two, three, four. Okay, these high low pinches. One, two, three, four. Leave it. One, two, three, four. Kettle ball. Okay. Last four minutes. Yeah, I know. Come on. Ready? Go high, high, low, low. One, two, three, four. Pick up your weight. I'm just gonna use the actual kettle ball. Okay, when you kettlebell or your weight, you have a good weight squat. Okay, you're squatting up and you're lifting and thrusting with your shoulders. Okay, but you the weight is not going above your shoulders. Okay, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. 
Everything's in fours. Two, three, four. Swing it back down and reset. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I'm punching side to side. Okay. Two, three, four. Set it down. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Pick up the weight. Come on. We've got this. It's your last round. Okay. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Okay. Slowing down. You need to take a breather. Yeah. So you're halfway through. You have two minutes left. Okay? Yeah, I know. This is a long round. It's meant to be long. Ready? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now these might, your kettle balls aren't going to be as fast as your punches, okay? Because I don't want you swinging like this. Uh -uh. Drop that booty down. Drop it down. Okay? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Grab. One, two, three, four. Swing it all the way down. One, What did I just do? Y'all did awesome. All right, let the heart rate come down a little. Okay. Shake out your neck. Don't know about yours, but mine's a little tight. We are going to actually stretch on the floor. Okay. So let's go ahead and have a seat. Put one leg out, curl the other one in, and reach for your Okay. And just hang out here. Okay. I like to pull the bottom of my foot up. Gives me that nice good calf stretch at the same time. We're getting a good hamstring stretch. Oh. All right. Ready to switch it. Three, two, one. Switch sides. Yeah. All right. As always, tell me what you think. 
subscribe if you want. It would help me. It tells me that you like the page, that you like what you're seeing. I'm always welcome feedback, constructive feedback. If you like a move, you didn't like a move. Ooh, what about this move? Okay. If you ever have questions about form, when I do this, I don't feel it here. Am I doing this right? Okay. You can send me little clips. Okay. You can send me a message and I can get you some contact info. All right. Let's turn this knee, fix it the other way. We're going to do a quad stretch from here. Okay, so you're going to go back on your elbows. You're going to raise up your glute. You're going to squeeze it. You should feel it up and down this quad right here. Okay? If you don't, what you're going to try, if you don't feel it, try lifting this hip up just a little bit. Then you should feel it. Lots of squats, lots of lunges. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna go to the other side. Switch it out. Good. I don't think you do any burpees. Sprawls. I'm gonna have to rethink this next time. I always have some in there. Just consider yourself lucky. Mm -hmm. All right. I'm going to sit it up in three, two, one. Ah. All right. I like to sit with my feet together. Kind of gives the inner thighs Stretch. But at the same time, we're going to bring this arm across your body. Okay. Work out that shoulder. Stretch out that tricep. It's doing up and over. Because, you know, you worked. You worked your shoulders. You worked your arms. You worked your everything. Right. Shoulder. <laughs> Up. Oh. And you all made it through kickboxing and lifting number three. It's always, I love you. And until we can see each other in person again, peace out.